it's me island girl queen drew this is gonna be like the fourth time that i've started this video jesus Christ. like my life is broken so yeah <coughs> keep doing a bunch of shit anyways if the quality or the how dark or light it is is going like i can't at this point i'm done it's whatever i can't anyways from the title guys you already know what we're doing today we're doing an unboxing for brandon blackwood which is a luxury handbag um line person whatever um yeah uh, before we get into it if you're new to my channel please like comment subscribe if you haven't thank you for being here thank you for coming if you are subscribed to me welcome back thank you guys so much for subscribing i hope you guys continue to enjoy my video yes so let's get into the unboxing because as you can see it went dark again like i can't i just can't and i don't know what's going on for my camera there goes the light again okay all right all right okay anyways okay well let's get in to the video okay so it's dark again it should get bright in a minute i don't like we're not gonna we're not gonna talk about it we're not gonna talk about it anyways um so yes guys before i get into the bag and what's not i just want to say that disclaimer because i i watch a lot of a lot of unboxing and they always have to say like this is their choice of buying certain bags and you know don't want nobody to say like the bag is too expensive blah, blah 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 so in this video i am going to go through cost i'm going to go through quality i'm going to go through is it worth getting a brandon blackwood bag and this is gonna be like a little series i want to do on my channel with different things that i would have gotten over the time yeah with different things i would have gotten over the time um whether it's like bags or shoes or whatever it's not always gonna be luxury items it's gonna be like whatever i find interesting so yeah so you guys stay tuned for that so let's get in to the unboxing okay so first thing first this is how the box looks it's all white all white it has like a shimmer shine to it too it's all white it has his name and i guess you can say his logo too because this is what it is on all of his stuff so it says brandon blackwood new york he's from new york if i didn't say that before so this is how the box looks right then i'm gonna open it and then from the jump inside the box is so classy so it just has brandon blackwood new york all over and it's shiny inside too and let me tell you the quality of the box is you know for those who don't know i live in the caribbean so for me to get stuff it has to go to like a miami shipping dress or a new york shipping dress shipping address and then it gets here so it's not like i'm getting it like straight from wherever i'm buying it from and it's coming straight to my door it has to travel away so knowing that the box is good quality especially for bags is very important and this box for sure is good quality like even if something's like even if you drop something on this but well, my phone is not that heavy like it's just gonna you know it's not gonna go through and damage your bag so the box i have to say is very very it's very much good quality
Okay, so um, let's get into what's in the box. So first thing first, you see, I guess just a packing slip. A packing slip with, you know, like their return policy or whatever. It has exactly what I ordered. So I ordered a Kendrick trunk. And that's what it has on the paper. So that's just what it says. It has my billing and shipping address. It has Brandon Blackwood. It has the email. So yeah, so this is what the one of the things that's coming there. And then you have the Brandon Blackwood note. Yeah. So I got this in my first bag too because I do have another Brandon Blackwood bag which I'll show you guys in a minute. So it just says thank you for your purchase and then it has his signature at the bottom. So this is what it looks like. I am perplexed on how dark this light is. Maybe it's just me but anyways but this is how it looks guys thank you note so it just comes with you know the thank you note and then the order the, the slip the packing order whatever so first thing first inside the box this is how it looks this is how your bag comes the dust bag but what's interesting is like it has this foam that curdles your bag too so your bag's in here and everything else is foam. So that's just extra protection for, you know, as I said, your bag is traveling so far when you live in the car. <laughs> when you live in the when you live in the Caribbean, your bag is traveling so far. So this is really good. Like the this, I love that. I love that. The bag has like this so your bag now get damaged tall like extra protection so that's really good okay so let's get into the bag the most important part so it comes in this dust bag which the dust bag too it's very very thick yeah the dust bag is very thick and everything yeah so Yeah, and it's my way off here. Okay, so let's get into the bag. Wait, y'all already seen the color. I was about to say, comment in the comments um, what color you think I got. But so this is the bag. Isn't it cute? It's super, super. Are you? super cute like the color is amazing let me take out because like the color of this bag to die so it's like a neon let me tell you the exact name it is the yellow green nylon with brass meaning it has like gold hardware so like yeah we have we, we just had to get into the color first i don't know if the camera is doing the color justice if it looks more yellow than green because right now it looks like it looks yellow but it's more like a like what it says it's more like a yellow green it's like in between so yeah this is that so let me show you guys all the little details so it comes with, I don't know what this is. Let's see what this is. Oh, so this is just, I need a scissors. So this is just basically how to care for your bag and what it's made from. It's made from vegan leather um wait no so i guess this is just the different the 
the different bags like what the different bags is made from so they have pony hair vegan leather genuine leather suede and shirling shirling so it just tells you under each one it tells you how to care for your bag so i think this is the vegan leather i'm not sure what i think this is the vegan leather i don't know but it says all products are created one by one by our craftspeople. Each bag has been produced by unique techniques, special treatments, and hand finishing results. So, yeah, so that's what comes on the bag. Just how to care for it. Then, let me take off this so you guys can see the handle. So, the handle is definitely out. Out. Okay. I can't get that I can't get this off so this is how it looks this is the handle it comes with you know plastic on the top where the B is the detail of the B that's the clasp so open it and then it's just gold hardware and then the bottom has like four in case you just want to you know sit it down and make it look cute so this is it right so let's open it so let me show you guys so for the the opening you just lift this up lift up and then the bag opens like that I really need a scissors to cut this shit off and the bag opens like that so this is how inside the bag looks so it definitely comes with a strap in case you want to you know wear it as a crossbody or over your shoulder real cute the strap is the same color as the bag with the the gold hardware which is super cute so the straps go on here right there and right there so whereas other bags would have the straps at the side, is on the top. So the bag hangs. <laughs> Cute. Right? So yeah, so inside is all black. It has like a suede material in the inside. And then at the back, it just has the Brandon Blackwood New York engraved in it like. Yeah, super cute. And yeah, so it's a, oh. Oh, bitch. so you just close it about the same way you got it open, and that's the bag. Like it's super super cute. Okay, so let's get into cost. I'm actually gonna. I bought. The one I bought before, I think, was cheaper than this one because this one is actually pretty big. I honestly did not know that it was gonna come like this size, but I'm not. I'm not mad. Um, I'm into smaller bags right now, but this is still a really good size. I'm. I'm gonna show you guys the first one I got, which is smaller. But let me just tell you guys about cost so I'm going directly on the site which is www.brandonblackwood.com okay so this is a Kendrick trunk so if you do go and search because he has other styles of bags but this specifically is a Kendrick trunk having a Valentine's Day collection thing going on let me search for yellow green in your trunk okay so right now I'm not signed in but I'm not signed in 
so it's actually giving me the EC price which if I'm signing I change my location to the US so it gives me the US price so right now the EC price for the bag is $765 let me show you guys that's if it's gonna oh if you guys can see that's the you know what I'm gonna put it on the screen I'll put it on the screen so right now it's 765 EC which is 765 divided by 2.7 which is like 283 284 US and <clears throat> That's just the price of the bag. When you go through checkout or whatever, they still add taxes, so it's a little bit more. Yes, it's a little bit more. So it's like seven, probably seven seventy EC maybe. But yeah, so um, let's get into the quality of the bag now, since you guys knew the price. As I said, it is genuine leather. I don't know if it's vegan leather or just plain old leather like what it says in the book I have to to, to see but I I can already tell I'm going to have this bag for years upon years like the quality of it how sturdy it is everything is very much years to come and a bag like this is timeless like because it's like the the color of it is very timeless and because it's one color because he has printed trunks I'm gonna be wearing this over and over again so to me I would say it is worth it maybe not to like do a cut to be honest a lot of people collect bags like a collection I'm not sure about having like a Brandon Rockwood bag collection to be honest because the only bags that I'm really interested in in what he sells are the trunks like the, the Ken these like the Kendrick trunks those are the only bags that I find like super cute and it's mostly because of certain colors so I mean yeah so um, to me it is worth it if you at least get one if you want to just to have like a statement piece because even the shape of this bag is very different you know what I mean it's totally different it's very cute it can pop any outfit imagine this with a flowy dress like a fuchsia flowy dress with this amazing before I go let me guys let me show you guys the first Brandon Blackwood bag I got which it's a different material this I believe this is probably vegan leather because it's like if you feel that if you hear that it's like one of those type of it's one of those type of materials so another thing with keeping it good too you'll probably have to keep it very much in the dust bag because I don't know how you would like if it gets stained up I don't know how with this material how it would go that's another thing but with my first run and back with bag, it's like a different material. So this is how it came. And let me tell you how they upgraded. Because I got this bag like, when did I get this bag? Like two years ago? Last year? I got this bag like last year for my birthday. Was it last year? No. I think so. I think I got this bag last year for my birthday. So it's been a minute. But the quality of the bag like went up so much because this is like a a cloth like a literal cloth material and this is more like a like a canvas bag type thing so that's that's one difference so this is my first brandon backward you see how small it is compared to this one i really didn't know this one was gonna come so big but this is how small it is compared to this one and this one has silver detail and this one doesn't have the B at the top like it's just one of these so you 
open it. It's the same detail inside. Still has the, you know, the black suede inside. This one comes, came with a strap too. I never use the strap. I wore this bag like once, twice. But I never use the strap bag from them. It's just the same. It's the same Kendrick trunks, but there's different sizes. And this one didn't come with this on the, the tag either. So they're definitely like upgrading their packaging and all that stuff as they go along, I guess. But it came with the same thank you notes, the same thank you note, and all those other things. But the sizing, just pay attention to the sizing if you're actually trying to get like a smaller, little cute one instead of like this big one. But that's what it is. But yeah, I love both. I think both, as I said, is gonna be around for a very long time once I keep it in the dust and and not get it like squashed up and stuff like that. So yeah. yeah. Anyways guys that is the end of the video. If you guys have any questions about the bags or any questions about anything you guys can comment below and let me know. Auden is running the sink water on blast. He doesn't do his thing. He thinks he's silent in the back. I'm a believer. I can hear every single thing under the sun. And the thing is, he's trying to be quiet, but he's not. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, if you're not subscribed, subscribe to my channel. If you guys want more videos like this, as I tell you, I want to do a series. You guys can let me know other things you guys want me to review or unbox. And yeah, so thank you so much for watching. Bye.